Hello everyone and welcome to Great Leveler Gaming. I am the Great Leveler and today we have another trailer reaction. Today we are reacting to The Day Before. This is an announcement trailer, it's a brand new game, brand new series. I don't think he's coming to console, those of you who follow the channel know I'm a console player, PlayStation in particular. Um, but at the same time, this from the little bits I've gathered from uh, seeing web pages and stuff that announcing it, uh, it sounds like right up my street, so I'm really intrigued to check it out. Anyway, it's a five minute trailer. So, with that being said, let's crack on. Billionaires is Fortune Rise 27 percent during the pandemic. Short gameplay demonstration trailer oh, for The gameplay. Day Before, an upcoming open world multiplayer survival game. Oh, the Day on. Before features a huge, stunningly detailed post apocalyptic world destroyed by a terrible virus. Yeah, so this is what I'd heard about the massive online Great, man. zombie awesome. uh, world, and it just sounds awesome. Look around here, I guess. Oh, okay, that was a uh, strange animation getting out of the car. Sure, many people though jump straight out of the car. Like up. Yep. I'll find out what's in the skyscraper. Okay, and I'll look around here. Now, this could be coming to console. It definitely looks within the realms of possibility on console, but it might just be a see what we have here. Uh, later release. Alright, alright, alright. I have found <laughs> a great cowboy hat. Tell her everything's alright. And there aren't any more guns in the valley. Easy, cowboy. That looks awesome. Listen up. Look at the reflective this is surfaces. Survivor colony speaking. If you can hear this message, it means that we have opened our doors for new survivors. We can give you food and shelter and ensure your safety. Here are the coordinates. Oh. Did you hear that? Yep, I got a message too. Great. Maybe I can sell my junk there and get the myself a better rifle. The only problem with a Find game like this is if in the survivor colony, you can sell and buy any items as well as cooperate with other players. Okay, that's fair enough. The problem with big multiplayer online games like this is that sometimes graphically they start to suffer. Uh, depending on how big a server you're getting, if it's only 10, 20 people, then maybe this is feasible, but if there's up to 60 players, I'd be impressed if it can maintain something as graphically gorgeous as this. In The Day Before, you can enter abandoned buildings and take whatever you want. The main thing is to be careful, because not all players are friendly. No, no shit. Get out of here. You gotta love the voice acting. Oh shit. Got company. Could use some help now. The things are about to get heated. Over here. So it looks like ammo is gonna be generous, which is a good thing. Oh god, the explosions are awesome! But you see, one of the things I have a question there is he could hear the other players, but when he was Dude, calling his teammate, I, I gotta go upstairs. Um, they couldn't hear okay, him. I'm running toward you. Don't know how that's gonna the work. The snowstorm is starting right now, and the temperature is falling fast. Oh, Ooh, is temperature gonna play into it? Remember oh yes, when you bottom left corner. Make unnecessary noise, it can attract unwanted guests even more Fuck. terrifying than other players. Mm -hmm. See now this would be fun if you could roll zombies towards other players. Um, the world of the day before is teaming with hungry hordes of bloodthirsty infected. Yeah, that could, this could be really fun. Oh pieces. shit! Oh, Thankfully that lift is working. Should have seen this shit. It seems he dodged a bullet. Now he's crafting a bandage so he doesn't die from bleeding. Oh, this looks hey, are you upstairs awesome. already? This looks right on my street. Oh dear. Oh shit. God, that's like him. Um, I am legend. That section where they're all just. <laughs> that's cool. That is terrifying. Where are you? Oh shit! What's happened to his mate? I'm digging this. This looks absolutely awesome. Oh, 
tensions building. Yep, sounds like. What the? Oh dear. That looks cool. The day before, coming soon. Yeah, so currently it's just a Steam release. Um, so, obviously, it's just for PC, which is fine. It does look like a very technically accomplished game, so I can understand why it probably would come to console, or at least, again, not straight away. But, wow, looks awesome. I've currently uh, purchased Daisy. I know, way behind. Um, and I love the potential of that game. The zombie hordes and playing against other players. But it doesn't hold a candle to that. That looks phenomenal. The size of the hordes for one. Even if it was just, uh, for example, you could only play with four friends and there was no other enemies. That looked impressive. But the fact that there's other players in the server, that could be something really really interesting really just spectacular whether they'll manage to accomplish that we all know how they can make trailers look great and they can give it a graphical boost because you're only seeing a small section of the map and obviously if it's a huge city will they be able to maintain that level of prettiness with multiple players and massive hordes skeptical I am skeptical, optimistic, but skeptical. But either way, like I said, I won't be able to play it, but I would love to check out the gameplay of it. Close to time, I'm going to keep my eye out for it because it does look a lot fun. Something I would absolutely love to play with my friends, and I'm sure they would be, you know, just as excited about it as well. Uh, but what, what do you guys think? Um, do you think it's a bit too ambitious, or do you think it's? Uh, more of the same, is it just DZ with prettier graphics and just not as well executed? I think it looks fantastic. I'm literally just, I want some engagement. I want you guys to let me know what you think down below in the comments. So I'm posing questions. Sue me. Don't sue me. I have got no money. Uh, but yeah, let me know down below in the comments. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, remember to hit that like button, comment, all that stuff. And I'll see you all on the next video. Coming soon. Bye. Day before, coming soon.